What's going on guys? It's Greg back with the Super 6. A uh, beautiful day out here today. Um, I hope everybody is doing well. Um, since I had, you know, time on my hands, you know, with all the uh, coronavirus and stuff going around and everybody's pretty much homebound, I uh, decided to go ahead and today, after I finished all my honeydew chores, I uh, decided to just pull out the uh, chin spoiler pieces and get those sanded. Um, I've already sanded one of them here. Um, the first step is going to be to sand it and prime it and then um, get it ready for painting. Uh, and then this is what they look like. If you didn't see it in my last video, this, this is what they look like out of the box. And it's uh, fiberglass, so it definitely needs to be sanded before I put that primer on it. So I got some um, 180, well first let me show you the part one that I sand. So once you sand it, um, it looks really dusty, but you want to get a nice score, fine score on there so that um, primer will adhere to it. So I think I got a pretty good sand on it. So the next step is going to be to wash it. Uh, or wet sand it inside of this bucket here with a little bit of soap and then uh, hopefully it'll be ready to be primed after that but the sandpaper I use is a 180 grit 3M sandpaper it's very fine gives you a real nice score without putting um, you know a rough texture on your surface so that it could be painted but this is where I am now I've got a sand this one and prep it and get it ready and um, I think we're gonna be on our way um, so yeah but I hope everybody's having a good day um, and then this is just one of several steps that we're gonna be taking to get the chin spoiler ready and getting it painted and getting it installed on the car so just kind of bear with me just thought I'd take you guys through the process you know since you know I'm already doing it so but I hope everybody's having a good day and uh, stay tuned for uh, for the next step. Okay, guys, got both parts uh, sanded down and washed. Uh, no dust on them. Got a nice. Uh, still got a couple of drops of water there, uh, but no dust on them. Like I said, it's just fiberglass, so all you need is just a really light uh, sanding on them, just to score it well enough for the primer to adhere to the surface of it so I think everything's going uh, great so far and then I'm also going to take off my rocker panels uh, like I said before take off my rocker panels again and get those repainted and sanded uh, but like I said the main thing is uh, getting a chin spoiler on all right so we are ready for primer and uh, that step is coming up all right guys got uh got the uh, chin spoiler pieces primed um and i think it came out really nice uh, looks like the uh, the paint is going to adhere to it pretty good so i should have better luck with these this time than i did the first time i did my rocker panels so you know everything's about trial and error i never done this quite before when i did the rocker panel so i'm still learning so hopefully i've taken the right steps <clears throat> and getting them prepped for paint so uh, that's going to be it for this video so stay tuned for part two when I actually um, get these ready for the uh, the uh, top coat or the base coat uh, which is the granite crystal metallic base coat and um, I think I'm probably going to have to just do another little light sanding on the primer before I put that base coat on there to make sure that's nice and scored so that base coat will stick. And so that's what that video will be about. And also applying the clear coat on the top. So I appreciate you guys watching and that's gonna be all for this video. Hope everybody's doing well and staying safe. And I'll get at you guys later. Later.